Hi, Mr. Clash here with a Pentahound base attack and replay. Uh, it's only my second time using five Lava Hounds and only my fourth time with Hounds in general. First thing you'll notice is this is not a Max Town Hall 9. It's Max Town Hall 8 with new Town Hall 9 weapons and some Expos. So that's the first thing you'll notice. Now, the plan I had for this was to come in with one balloon to lure onto this cannon to lure the clan castle out. Only one balloon. Two would have taken it out, taken that cannon out, but I didn't want that cannon to be destroyed. It needed to stay. The reason is, I'll clear that away. If that cannon was gone, then I could not path any balloons into the mortar. And the reason I knew that is if you draw a line between the defences that would be left. Wiggly line. And then come perpendicular out from the middle of that line. Then the only way to get anything to that mortar would be to drop it within this triangle here. And as you can see, that was not possible. Anything dropped on that side of the line would path to the archer. So the cannon had to stay for part of my plan. So the plan was one balloon in here to lure the fl uh, flying units that could attack flying units or any units that could attack flying units from the clan castle. I wasn't concerned about balloons or anything because it's an air attack. To then drop one archer on this lab with my archer queen as the kill squad for what was in the clan castle. As it turns out it's a dragon. As the dragon's up here, I just kept dropping an archer, dropping an archer, dropping an archer to keep the dragon preoccupied. Once that was down, the plan was to drop my barb king onto this camp so this archer would target him then come in with my balloon uh, air attack so lava hand lava hand and then three lava hands on this one because that's where the archer queen was and then i would have my balloons two balloons two balloons targeted balloons that way they didn't have to sort their own path out that would, that's how I wanted my balloons to, to travel. They would then be raged. Well, I would put a rage smack bang on the air defences. Uh, any pups would rage up and, and I just felt that was the right place to put them. And as that progressed, the pups would take out the queen and as it progressed, I saved some balloons for the back end just in case. That was the plan. I figured there were some, I figured all the Teslas would be here in the middle. So, yeah, that's the plan. Uh, the size of my heroes didn't really matter because they're not involved in taking out the base and they were really only for the kill squad or clean up. So level five Archer Queen with the ability with the Royal Cloak to help take out the clan castle and the King under Rage would be enough to take out the clan troops. So um, they didn't need to be level 20 or level 30 or anything like that. So let me clear this off and we'll have a look how that attack went. Okay, here we are. So the balloon is down, going in for the lure, and the archers will start opening fire on that balloon. There they go. And the dragon's out. So I've just dropped the archer up the top onto the lab. So it's a bit of a prolonged lure and kill process, but it was the safest place for me to do it that 
fit with my plan. So once the dragon gets up there and I drop the archer queen, I keep dropping archers down to keep the dragon from targeting onto the queen. Now I did have one more archer left that I thought no, no need. But after one breath from the dragon, I thought no, I better activate her ability. So now the Lava Hounds are coming in from the bottom, two on the left and three on the right. Followed by the Surgical Balloons, two, 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 two and two, all the way around. And then I, at that point I think I dropped my Barb King, but I didn't. Uh, the Rage Spells go down and I'm watching the balloons, everything seems to be covered okay. The Teslas pop, uh, the Queen's chasing Lava Hounds and the other rage spells go down and now it's about time to bring in the back end balloons. Now I've thought I did drop the Barb King, but I dropped him on the army camp and I got the red little thing on the screen that says you can't put him there, but I'd ignored that. I didn't know what it was. I wasn't paying attention. I was just too busy to get my rage spells down. So at this point it's clean up everything the base is totally demolished and I'm pressing the king to rage him and I can't see his little rage silhouette appearing his rage halo appearing on the battlefield so I don't know where he is and I don't know what's going on so I've got plenty of minions though so I'm not too really worried about it the balloons have spread there's plenty of time left on the clock and after they take out this uh, king, I do have one archer that's sitting on the left hitting a wall. And that archer is going to uh, move and trigger a skelly trap there. They just triggered it. And all the minions and balloons go running after the skellies. Uh, they probably needed to go up the top anyway to get the deck storage, but the minions are taking care of that. So I need the one last gold storage to go and game over. No king needed, didn't matter the hero strength.